Hello, you beautiful people. This is Tooth, Tooth Decay. So, while we're in Ogwin, my mates and he wanted an English breakfast, so I says to him, right, we go down Mass Palomas, right? The uh, typical English uh, tourist spot. So, we went to a, a restaurant with an Italian name, Chow Chow, had an English breakfast, cooked by a German in Spain. It weren't great, what'd you expect? But actually, the rest of the day, it was nice to see the gaff. We're not a massive fan of these touristy places, but I've got to be honest, um, you know, for a one day, I, I don't mind it. So, you know, the, the missus and my mate's missus had a mooch around the shops, me and him had a little mooch. Um, found some very, <laughs> some very rude items as we were out and about. Avert your eyes now if you do not want to see this. Um, I, I reckon my mate might look quite good doing the barbecue in one of them. But anyway, the girls were more interested in the clothes, to be fair, rather than ding dong. Um, so there they, there they were, spending away the money. We popped off, um, we had some cocktails and bits and pieces. That's literally just a few feet on from where you saw us. Lovely bar there that's got, goes all the way through to the seafront. And they had a couple of pool tables in there as well. Um, really weird, they, they, if you ain't got change, they just give you like hundreds uh, or, or like a euro for the pool table and stick it on your tab. Um, that feels really weird to be in English, like, you know, the, if you could imagine going in a pub over here and saying, guess two quid for the pool table, stick it on me uh, tab, it just wouldn't happen, would it? Anyway, then there's them not being Herberts. This is the sand dunes of Mas Palomas, these are all protected. It was really, really windy the day that we went down there. I mean, really windy, so much so that when we were walking along the front, we had grit, sand grit in our teeth. So we got a cab over to Melanera's, which is just on the other side of the little outcrop there. This was a beautiful little beach. It really was. Absolutely stunning. It's a lot smaller. And so there's a, a good few restaurants up the back there. We went in, funnily enough, another one called Chow Chow. Nothing to do with the Chow Chow that was in Mas Palomas. Italian restaurant, really, really nice. Um, we just, I think we paid like 14 euro for two sun beds and a, and a parasol. And we just laid out there for a few hours, just having a bit of a chillax and everything. It was really nice, um, just lying there with the waves coming in. We didn't actually go into the sea there. There was quite a lot of little rocks and we didn't have reef shoes or nothing like that with us and we, we were in relax mode by that time anyway. But yeah, you can go up to the bars up the back. They'll give you plastic cups if you want to bring your drinks back down. No issues with any of that. Um, Mrs. Toop's just gone up to get another one right now. And like I said, the lunch up there was absolutely brilliant. Um, it's just something else to do, right? It's, it's another little day out. Uh, I'd really recommend this over Mas Palomas. Yeah, do Melaneras, people, do Melaneras.